We apologize in advance for my brother Ryan's actions in this video. Viewer discretion is advised. This is us building our slide. We made it out of wood from our old kitchen and Kara's dad's previous projects. The process involves cutting, screwing, hammering, and sanding the slide, which made it usable. The first step was picking a reasonably sized piece of wood. Then we cut it to make it the perfect size and sanded it so splinters were not an issue. Next, we put the pieces together and screwed and hammered them into place. Afterwards, we put the three main boards on, the front board and the two side boards that kept the balls from falling off. Lastly, we put in supports which make the slide not fall over. Newton's third law of motion is for every action force, there's an equal and opposite reaction force. The statement means that in every interaction, there is a pair of forces acting on the two objects. The action of the ball hitting the water creates the reaction of the water splashing and the ball popping up. Using one slide, we were able to demonstrate friction. The difference in the slides were the different substances that created friction, which made the tennis ball go at different speeds. For example, when there was nothing on the slide, there was a lot of friction, so the tennis ball went slower. When there was saran wrap on the slide, there was friction to make it go slower than the slide with water, but faster than the slide with nothing on it. This is Maddie's brother being weird. The action was Ryan throwing the ball at Maddie, and the reaction was Maddie getting hurt, and therefore, getting mad. And also kicking his butt later! When there was water on the slide, the tennis ball went the fastest of all three because there was the least amount of friction. The gravity pulls you to the bottom of the slide faster when the slide has the ran wrap on it, is a water slide, or the slide is at a steeper angle. Gravity makes the speed of the slide faster. The energy conversion is gravitational potential energy to, to kinetic energy plus thermal energy. Gravitational potential energy occurs when the ball is held at the top of the slide. The potential energy occurs when the ball is pulled down the slide by gravity. Thermal energy, aka friction, slows the ball down while, it's, while it is going down the slide. The ball goes faster when the saran wrap or water is added to the slide because it decreases the friction. Speed is the rate at which something is able to move or operate found by distance over time. The greater the speed of the slide, the faster you go and the more fun you have. The equations that show this are 60 divided by 1.202 equals 49.9 inches per second. That was for the regular slide. For the water slide, it would be 60 divided by 0.7882, which is equal to 78.1 inches per second. And for the saran wrap slide, it would be 60 divided by 0.8342, which is equal to 71.9 inches per second. Velocity is the speed of something in a given direction. The equation that shows this is distance over time plus direction. Velocity is important to this project because the velocity determines the direction that the tennis ball is going. The equations that are necessary to show this are, for the regular slide, it is 60 divided by 1.202 equals 49.9 inches per second southwest. For the water slide, it is 60 divided by 0.7882, which is equal to 76.1 inches per second southwest. And for the Sharan wrap slide, it is 60 divided by 0.8342, which is equal to 71.9 inches per second southwest. In all, we had a great time doing this project. Thank you.